With 692 career wins, five Coach of the Year awards, four National Junior College Championships, a MAC Championship, and an NCAA Regional appearance, Ryder baseball coach Barry Davis is entering his sixth year at the helm of this Division I program. With 11 years on the junior college level, Davis was able to make the transition to Division I baseball in 2004 when named the head coach at Ryder University. Um, you know, baseball is baseball, and, and you, and you want to be able to teach the game, you want to be able to coach the game, and you know, it's competition, so there's different levels. Certainly here, the level's a little bit more competitive, so we want to make sure that, you know, we're doing little things on a little bit higher level, you know, on and off the field. Uh, academic, a little bit more challenging here, so the student's going to have to be a little more accomplished student. So, but as far as the competition, the game's the same, the nine innings, three outs, you know, play the fundamentals, and I I think as long as you have the personnel to do it, you can do it. When a player looks to play baseball here at Ryder, it is key for Coach Davis to make sure that the player realizes that the education comes first. If you're coming here to Ryder, you know, our number one goal, obviously, is to, is to get an education, is to get a degree. I think that is important. I think guys that come here that don't have that as part of their, their main goal, I think they're missing out because I think that's what we're looking for. We're looking for guys that want to be good in the classroom. We're looking for the discipline that they have in the classroom. And normally that translate into, and if they love the game, it'll translate to on the field. And I think, you know, they go hand in hand. We've got to be good in the classroom. We've got to want to be, you know, you've got to look ahead. What are you going to be doing in five to ten years? Where do you see yourself? I meet with these guys all the time and I ask them. And a lot of them are very focused in what they want to do, and some of them are not as focused. And we want to get them focused, get them thinking about what they, what are they going to do when they're not playing anymore, because you can't play forever. There's a very low percentage of guys that play college baseball that are going to play uh, professional baseball. So we want to make sure that they understand that from the get-go. And uh, I think it's important for a guy that, that when they come here, that education is, is number one. And if it's not number one, it's 1A. Over his career, Coach Davis has seen 17 of his players make it to the professional level. It was the experience that they had while playing under him that matters more, and not how many he has seen go to the pros. I don't go home and count up how many you know guys I had that you know that I thought I influenced. Well, I think I have an influence one way or the other, whether they think it's good or bad. At the time, they may think I'm crazy. You know, they may think that why is this guy on me every second? You know. Well, usually when you're getting on him, a coach is getting on a kid, he, give, he cares about the kid's development, you know, whether it be an off the field situation or an on the field or a practice situation or, or a learning, any, any learning opportunity. S some guys come back and, and, they, and, they, and they'll thank you and they really appreciate it. Other, others, you know, may appreciate you from afar, you know, but as long as you, they know that you have their best interests at hand, that I think it does, it does tend to work out for you in the long run. And I think that's why you see alumni follow you know, coaches and, and they support their programs because they had a good experience. And that's what we want. With 646 career wins and his recent success here at Ryder, Coach Davis touches on his keys to success on the college level. It starts with the players. You need the better players. You need good players. You need, you know, you need guys that have good character, that have good work ethic, that have, uh, you know, that care about the program. You know, and you put you put those guys together. You know, you end up with a pretty good group. Now, you want the highest skill player, obviously, you can get. And I think from a baseball standpoint, if we're very good pitching you know, and playing defense, that usually is a determining factor in how good you can be. So I, that would be one of the emphasis is being very good on, uh, you know, on the mound. And, uh, you know, you look at all the great teams, they've always had great pitching. So I think that's a key that we try to focus in on. You know, but overall, to having the best, the best players, you know, with the best character, the best work ethic, and the ability to get better year in, year out.